Hello everyone, welcome back to Daffy Dragon. In this video, we will create a Honeypot token and uh, we will deploy a smart contract and add the liquidity on the Pancake app and try to buy and sell tokens. So, uh, this uh, Honeypot uh, token is basically a uh, user can buy the tokens but cannot it sell. So, when it's try to sell on the Pancake app, it's automatically give. Uh, error so let's try it and uh, we will get code here and here in the remix we will click on the contract and create new file and name it honeypot dot soul and we will paste the contract here so in the contract uh, here is the line number 140 we will change the name here honeypot and uh, in the line number 70 we will change the symbol like hh or hyp and also give it name okay so decimal uh, will be uh, zero and uh, then it, here is the total supply like uh, it's uh, four zero so uh, let's see how much it's generate the token so there is nothing to be i think change okay here if you want to uh, specific the owner of the wallet address or you can msg dot sender okay and that's it nothing to be changed so we will match our compiler version 5.17 we will click here on the compiler so come down to the 5.617 and click on the compile okay so I make sure there is no lessons and now we will deploy here wallet connect So it's main net. We have to change the network in the MetaMask. We will choose okay. Choose Sepolia network. Already here is transaction. Okay. Okay, we will deploy on this Sepolia. Well, so I already tell you that we will add liquidity on pancake swap. Okay, then we can just uh, BSC scan. So let me add the network in the MetaMask. So we can choose the network here BSC testnet and come down and add BSC testnet network in the MetaMask use MetaMask okay approve switch network okay come back okay now here is the network is 9 uh, 97 and also the amount of the bnb here we have and we have to choose the contract here so we will choose this contract the last one this honeypot so we will choose here honeypot and we will deploy it 
or transaction will be generated on the metamask we will pay some fee confirm it okay so here is the contract generated and here is the transaction and we can also search here the contract address just wait a little bit it will be fetch the data sometimes it's not uh, correctly uh, getting the ABI okay now as you see we just refresh it one two times so it's getting the data it's in the token name is token symbol and if we click on it so decimal will be zero and here is the four zero is 10,000 uh, token okay so <clears throat> as we see here is one multiply 10 double time 4 so it's uh, 10,000 tokens okay so here uh, in this wallet uh, let's now pancake swap okay open it <coughs> Also, we can uh, import these tokens in our MetaMask. So, copy the contract address, click on the MetaMask. next connect so at this time we connected with the pancakes app also we can import tokens here so here is the option for importing tokens we can click on the import tokens and we will paste here the contract address we will copy from the bsc test net scan and make it next it will be fetch the token details let me check okay as we can see it's token and decimals next and uh, here is the amount of the tokens import so here right now the tokens in our wallet okay let's add the liquidity and bnb chain injected metamask approve it this is the main net because we are choosing here main net let's change the network to the test net click here and let me check the network we switch the network from mainnet to testnet so here we are connecting with the uh, testnet okay so trade liquidity add liquidity uh, we will choose the token we will paste here the address of our contract and we will import the tokens here 
okay so we will choose the percentage of the fee first we will here uh, mention how much uh, like uh, 10,000 tokens equal to uh, 1 BNB right the current or we can like this I think we will choose here amount uh, we have also token and uh, the price range minimum or maximum so we will make it full range because we are adding the liquidity first time and then we have to make it full range so here the amount of the tokens we want to add like uh, if we add uh, 100 or 1000 and then it will be choose 0.1 TBNB so we will make it uh, unable and approve the tokens now add it in the liquidity pool so it will be create a pool confirm it okay so right now we have add the liquidity successfully and the pool is created now we can buy or sell the honeypot token so let's go back to the swap and change the wallet like as a user we want to buy and sell the tokens and I will choose Mm, add a new wallet create okay okay so we have to connect with it okay connect so we are connected and uh, now we will also paste here our contract okay now i want to buy like uh, one token right mm, 10 okay okay let's buy 10 tokens So we add uh, the 10 tokens successfully. Okay, and uh, let's update it. The balance is 10. Now we want to sell them back. So I will change here, make it maximum. Also, we can see here in the contract if we refresh it. we can see the details here so let's hmm, sell them back so make it maximum swap anywhere swap okay to confirm okay 
so first we will approve these tokens and then we can uh, sell it back so it's approved now it's a signature for the swapping so I hope uh, it will be through an error as you can see transfer from field so it's cannot sell this token back so there is the, uh, the type so of we have the contract so user can buy the tokens but cannot sell so it's very simple a uh, honeypot token that have by default uh, not able to sell the tokens to users